We are an Australian family who bought a boat on the other side of the world. Having sailed from Malta up through Italy to Greece, yes. the Mediterranean sailing season was coming to an end. We were warned off the Ionian by more than one person. Too crowded, too many charter boats was what we were told. Being here late in the season, we didn't really find this, but with its easy sailing and abundance of anchorages, it was easy to see why this area was so popular. By this stage, we really needed to make some plans for winter, so we decided to haul the boat out in Prevesa, a relaxed, charming town with three boat yards and all the marine services we could possibly hope for. Uh, and then it was a really good spot to, to haul Blue Dancer out and draw up a list of things that they needed doing and get stuck into it. And so just like that, our sailing season was over. As we looked back, we realised how quickly it had gone. It seemed like only yesterday that we were launching Blue Dancer in Malta and cruising through Italy. Um, my favourite thing about going sailing on Blue Dancer was meeting new people and discovering new places. Swimming and sleep, getting a bunk bed. I like, I like the food and the ice the game was really good and I like meeting um, new boat friends. The plan was to return to Australia over, over Christmas, catch up with friends and family. Um, we, we did a bit of that in the UK as well. And then the plan was of course in 2020 to get back into the water and get sailing and exploring the med. But little were we to know or anyone the twists and turns that 2020 had in store for all of us. 